question is what is your favorite step in the process of making a video? So one thing I love so much is making thumbnails. I just, I love it so much. Um, oh my cupcake, I don't even know. This is too difficult. <laughs> and I was the one who created this. And I can't even answer the whole, the whole question. Okay, um, hmm. So, I, I don't know. It's, it's such a, it's, making thumbnails is such a, like a minor thing though. But it's kind of like you're a movie poster in a way. And I think it's important to to care about that element. I don't know. I just really love it all. Like to be honest, I do. And I know that's such like a a typical answer, but it just is. Like I just love coming up with the ideas, writing it down, creating these characters. What is your big dream for your channel? My biggest dream is to make someone happy maybe even lead someone to Christ because that is where you're gonna get the everlasting joy just to impact a life just to help someone and you know maybe help someone out of a rut or just encourage someone and make someone happy and and that's my big dream, but also, <laughs> I know it's pretty typical, but it'd be really cool to maybe one day, like, have a t-shirt. <laughs> because, like, I, one thing, I, I, I already have designs for t-shirts in my head. I know no one would ever buy them now, but... It's just, it's still a dream of mine. Maybe, maybe one day, I don't know. Probably not, but maybe there's possibility, I guess. What is your dream job? Now, I think a lot of people would be surprised when I say this, but I, right now, my dream job is to be a fashion designer. I have too many things that I love. That's my problem is I love fashion, I love drawing, I love art, I love photography, I do love making videos. I think it would be really cool would be to be a YouTuber. God, God knows the plan and I'm just gonna pray that I follow God's will because I know his will is like, is fabulous. <laughs> it's perfect and he knows what is right for me, so I'm just gonna put that all on you guys, cause like, I don't even know what I wanna do. What? I took a picture. How would you describe LPS Tube? I would describe LPS Tube as being a community where young girls can come together. Well, you know, there also is a hand, like there's also a handful of boys in there, I guess, but it's a great community for young people <laughs> to come together. But LPS Tube is basically like mixing together, like in a blender, blending up all of the fruits, all of the jobs of like creating a movie. And it's typically with a ton of people, but mixing it all together, blending it all out, all together into a delicious smoothie. I'm using a sm smoothie analogy because smoothies are delicious. And that smoothie is an LPS deeper. What's your favorite smoothie, by the way? That's a random question, but I was talking about smoothies, so why not ask it? I really love berry smoothies. From afar, LPS tube is just, you know, a bunch of young girls and a handful of young boys creating videos with little toys. But when you look closer, when you take a, little, a few steps closer and look a little closer, like you take your magnifying glass out or your monocle, you take your monocle out <laughs> and you look at it, you notice that it's very complex. There's a lot that is involved in making a video. So take a skit for instance. You gotta come up with an idea. You gotta write down your idea in the form of words. 
And then you gotta express those words through video and you gotta act it out, you know, give your emotion or and then you gotta edit it, which editing is not an easy thing. Mm-mm. No, oh -uh. no, no, no. <laughs> It's not an easy thing. It takes lots of practice and lots of learning and lots and lots of time to edit. <laughs> and then you render it, you, you render it all up, you make it into one compact video, and you post it online. And somehow, for some reason, people decide to click on your video and watch your video and comment and like it. Like, it blows my mind that there there are people watching this right now. Hug. <laughs> what are some of your inspirations? I could go on and on and on about all of my favorite LPS tubers and people that inspire me. Because there are honestly so many. <laughs> of course, all of my friends, there amazing older videos always inspire me anna grace angel rose the guys um hannah other hannah of course like lps hannah she is just she's the queen <laughs> she's the queen oh hannah queen uh, hannah oh my goodness faith is amazing um, Emma, My LPS Pet World, Awesome Posh Productions, oh my goodness, there's too many out there, there's too many. Favorite part about being an LPS tuber? Making videos is really great, it's a really great part of that, and don't get me wrong, I love that, but definitely reading your comments and seeing you guys react to the videos is really just amazing. I remember someone commenting that it made their day and I was just like oh my gosh yay um guys make my day oh. some tips you would give to a new LPS tuber so number one is definitely to think through your username a lot of people just kind of jump into the generic <laughs> the generic pit of usernames don't Fall in. Obviously, if you want to, feel free to jump in, but to create a username that it's really unique and special, like you are, and not just LPS Cupcake 24 TV. <laughs> Number two is to make the videos. Make them, and you might have just a, a crappy camera or you know just a really simple editor but start making videos now don't wait don't push it off if you can start making them now a lot of people they want to get this nice equipment and everything because you know some of the more popular LPS tubers have that equipment but the thing is they started from the beginning just like you and the best really Thing, the best thing to do really is to start from the bottom and and, and um, it's really just to try it out because you don't even know like a lot of people they just go into something and they don't know if they're gonna like it and they invest in nice equipment and then they waste it you know and pushing it off and saying that oh well I'll get it when I have a camera or I'll get it when I have nice lights or whatever don't do that make your videos make them now <laughs> like if you can make if you have a camera on your phone if you have a table lamp you can if you have a window you can make videos okay if you got some LPS you got you know I've seen some amazing things done with an iPhone, like an like an iPod camera, like an iPhone camera. So just, just do it! Number three is to make friends. One thing that's annoying that a lot of you know kids tubers do is they go onto other people's channels and they say, go check out my channel. Well, you know what? Nobody's gonna check out your channel if you do that because everyone's annoyed by that. So just it's not a good idea. It's 
just not a good idea. People like to see nice comments and you know I've <laughs> I've checked out a lot of my subscribers channels just because I'm curious so if I see nice people I'm gonna be attracted to that and I'm gonna see what their channel is about and other things like the look of your channel is also important but go out there and make some friends introduce yourself to like everyone you know and try to find some op youtubers that are starting up too and um go out and just go out there and make some friends because that's one of the best parts about LPS Tube is the community. Even though there are, you know, mean people out, like no community can ever be perfect, but it still is a really great community that is very supporting and encouraging and and I just I met some of my best friends through LPS Tube. And I just like I, I, I can't even imagine not having them in my life. Like, it's just... <sighs> so go out there and make yourself some friends. So that is the in front of the camera tag. I would absolutely love to see you guys do this video, whether it be actually in front of the camera or not. Um, I will leave all of the questions down below, as well as some of my people that I tagged to do this video. Hope you all enjoyed this video. I hope you have a wonderful day. Slip it out! <laughs> I don't know if that worked. I don't think it worked. It maybe worked. Let's let's try that again. Slip it out. <laughs> oh my goodness. degrees in my room because of these lights. You're worth melting for.